hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel how you all doing guys today we're going to make a ladies cross tie with a fastening adjustable clips and those are the clips we're going to use for this adjustable stripes uh, cross tie for ladies now we're going to make the draft which is very very simple and easy to to do so what you need to get is just a fleshy marker a ruler and just a uh, tips so you look for a nice fabric to use um we're going to use this this africa print fabric which is called uh, tie a dye at the red is what we're going to use for this project so now guys let's just start it so guys now we're going to draft the the pattern so from the upper part i'm going to take one inch plus half inch so in allowance so we're going to mark 1.5 so at the bottom part since it's going to be on fold we're going to take two inch plus 0 0.5 uh, seam okay so we connect it together like this just too easy so we connect it connect it together like this so take 10 inches here yeah. from this logger part take 10 inches so from the upper part i'm going to trace the i'm going to mark 0 0.5 to meet the 10 inches okay so now we're going to like connect it together like this so i want the middle part here to be a little bit curved yeah so we trace it like this to mix the 2.5 k like that so that is it so don't forget when we are cutting this i'm going to add 0 0.5 at the tip here and 0 0.5 at the tip here because this place is going to be on food we've already had allowance here so we don't need to add anything anymore so this is it now i'm going to do the the other one so at the bottom part let me roll it first i'm going to take two inches here from here I take two inches guys and 0 0.5 so in a lens I put it there so what you are doing you make it very straight so I take it up like this that's it I'm going to take 10 inches plus so in a lens which is 10.5 10.5 here so I mark it like this and, and I mark it down like that so from this step when 0 0.5 here yeah 0 0.5 here I'm going to mark it down let me take 5 inches so just half it take 5 inches like this 5 inches so I'll take 0 0.5 0 0.5 Connect it together again. This. So on at this point, I will want it to be a little bit curved like this. So you can just go in by 0 0.2 or 0 0.1. So I just want it a little bit curved. So you have to indicate it. Cross. Ladies. tie 2.5 inches and fold 1.5 2.5 inches and 1.5 inches 
So now we cut it. So by 0 0.5. So what you need to do is just to to connect it to the angle like this. So you connect the other one. I still need to put uh, two point five uh, inches. So that is what you will do. So at this point, we're going to cut this place up. Cut this place up. So that is it. So now we're going to put on fabric. So we're going to put it on fabric now to cut. So as I said before, we're going to use this. Uh, I'm going to look for the so this is the back the back so you cut from the back I'm just because when I want to sew it I'll just turn it so you can pin it if you have enough pins so now I'm going to pin it and I will cut it this is Press the pasta out. Like this. Cut. So now we're going to take it to the sewing machine to, to put it together. See how easy it is. I'll be right back. I just need to. So what we need to do now, I'm going to turn it to. Yeah, this is the right side and this is the wrong side. So I need to. So it's like this. You need to sew it like this. So guys, before we sew it, make sure you have to make it two centimeter or one inch, so that the the clips will enter very well. Okay. So I've taken one centimeter, two, one inch. Okay. So I'm going to follow the line. I sew it down. See the way I mark it, then I take the 0 0.5 at the bottom here yeah? to sew it. Okay, so before we turn it out, we're going to trim this off. So the same thing we apply to this one. I'll make sure I so that now I'm going to trim it before I turn it out. The heel part is going to be the inside so so we're going to fold this like 2.0 in you see this then we now put it like this so this flat part is going to be up so is this flat part we're going to pull this so now I'm going to use pin to so we just need to top stitch here it at the middle part like so at this day we think I need something to push out okay so you see in between the this one so it will bring it back then we in to so we just fold it once so it's going to be inside like that so it's going to be like this. So after we finish sewing this part, so we're going to use the fastening pin. Then we decorate it. That is it. So I'll be right back. Pin it. This is how you adjust it. You can adjust it to fit your neck. And now we're going to the fastening. As I said before, we're going to take like three inches. Yeah upward so we've already marked it take another three inches so we can put the fastening pin all done so now we're going to pin it and start beautifying it 
for your leg. So I'm going to put this first. So this, so I think this is what I have for now, and this one will go well. Okay, guys. So I'm going to be this. Please do not give me a thumbs up. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye. Before. This is what we did now. Mm, 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 mm. The way this tie is soon. I can put it. Okay, when you wear something like off shoulder, you can just put it. Okay. So that is it. Bye bye. Bye bye.